Hi everyone, today I filmed this look and it is a look inspired by Katy Perry's new music video called Unconditionally. Um, it's just like neutral eyes with some lashes and then she had really dramatic blush on, like she had a lot of blush on and then she had like these dark very red lips. So if you want to see how to get this look just continue to watch. Okay so starting off foundation I'm going to use the number 7 Stay Perfect foundation in the shade Calico. And then I'm going to fill in my eyebrows using Fling by MAC. You could go in with a dark colour if you wanted to recreate the look perfectly. But because I'm blonde, if I use like a dark brown, it'd look a bit strange. So I'm just going to keep the natural colour but do quite a strong brow. Then taking Too Fierce Shadow Insurance, I'm going to pop that all the way the, on the lid from lash line to brow bone just to prime for our shadow. The first lash I'm going to take is from this Too Faced Insurance Policy Art Palette and it is the colour Glamazon which is this one here. She had like a light bronze all the way across the lid. So I'm just going to sweep that all the way across the lid and up to the crease. And then with a fluffy brush I'm just going to blend those edges just so they don't look so harsh. Next thing I'm going to do is take Tilima by Stila, which is like a matte mid-tone and I chose this one because it's not too warm but it's not too cool, it's nice and neutral. And she had this along the outer corner and through the crease. So you start right here and then you can work it in. And then at the outer corner it was winged out so you could put a piece of tape there if you wanted to. I'm just going to do it freehand. And then going with the black eyeshadow, any have will do. This one is just by Natural Collection, so it's just a nice cheap one. And what we're going to do with this is we're going to take it on an angled brush and we're just going to start pushing it into the lashes and smoke it up a bit. Then I'm going to quickly conceal my under eyes with Max Pro Longwear Concealer just to perfect the skin. And then I'm just going to set it with my Elf Tone Correcting Powder. With a really tiny brush I'm going to put this dark matte brown eyeshadow just along the lower lash line pushing it right into the lashes. And then back in with a Tolima and the same brush I'm just going to blend that out underneath the lower lash line. And then I'm going to add a quick coat of my Bourjois Volume Clubbing Mascara and then I'll add these Amazing Shine eyelashes and these are the Style 747 Short which they look like that and then we'll come back and finish off the rest of the face. Now, 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 now
Gonna contour as usual using my sleek contour kit and my Real Techniques Expert Face Brush. And she had a lot of blush on, so I'm gonna take this sleek blush in the colour Rose Gold and pop quite a lot of that on. But if you are trying to apply quite a lot of blush, you do want to start small. So make sure to tap it off first and build it up instead of just going in with loads because then it can look a bit silly. Okay, so that blush was shimmery, so I'm not going to apply a highlight because it's already kind of brought a highlight to my cheeks. So the last thing is the lips, and she had like a dark berry lip. So I'm going to take this lipstick by collection in the colour Revenge. It's like a dark. Okay, and this is the complete look. So it's quite dramatic on the cheeks and lips, but I really like the eyes. They're quite neutral and natural, but with the lashes it still adds enough drama. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it helpful and thank you for watching.